family is a big deal. So I was born and raised in Vietnam through the teenager and became uh, adult when I came here to go to college. So I am influenced both ways by the Vietnamese uh, background and also I am influenced by living in the U.S. for over 40 years. I was born in Saigon. Um, I came to the state for college at the age of 18. of the situation that communists took over the country, I ended up living in USA after I graduated from college. I'm black and Filipino. I'm Tamara Sims. I'm a fifth year graduate student and I'm working with Jeannie Tsai in the Culture and Emotion Lab. So it's from the time they are small they are already put the importance of the relationship between children and parents. From what I've seen, there's like there's an emphasis on like this family structure, like it's more nuclear in uh, in uh, Filipino families. Uh, East Asians value tradition compared to in Western cultures, um, innovation mm -hmm. is valued more. Thank which is New Year time, we have to uh, write and contribute to the school magazine. And I can see like 90% of the topic was talking about the love to, um, you know, to their parents. So Chinese Americans in general across all age groups uh, viewed old age more positively than European Americans. When the parents get age or the grandparents get, 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 get age, children just supposed to take care of them. That's part of the insurance and warranty the life of an aging Asian family or the Vietnamese family in particular. The kids go out and provide for the like elders of the family. Elders you're supposed to take care of them, so my parents have seven children. So seven of us taking turn and taking care of the parents parents when they're getting old. But now, like in my generation, I only have two daughters. So now, with the hope of the two daughters taking care of us, it's a lot more responsibility for the younger generation than my generation. My dad jokes about that. He's like, yeah, you're just going to drop us off in a nursing home and forget about us.